strong. Friends, you know what to do. Get it in there. Nothing go, mate! I can't stand any more of that squalor! I miss lobster. I'll just sit the mentos, it's just making me more hungry. Tristan, aren't you? <laughs> I was always too pobre to be picky. Back in España, my papa, he make us chase the little song thrushes, you know, the little baby birdies. They're so fast. They catch one. <laughs> Two bites on you. <laughs> How did you find yourself up here? My papa bring us over here when just a little baby. My papa, he presidio on. He teach him about polvor. Do you know? The boom booms. <laughs> well, aren't we all thankful for that? <laughs> sure. Just be for the time. To the Guenos come. They killed my whole family. What sleep? Except for me, I get away. They tried to see me back to a swine. But they don't like that for me. So they put me in off an auto, you know, for the little bad boys. It's so bad. I run away. In time, I meet up with an old Montaigne, man. Baracho. He teach me the trappings and hauntings and skinnings, you know. Till one day, he died too. They stinky fur trade coming. They try to cheat me on my dineros. <laughs> One night, I sneaked down there. I burned the whole formica. <laughs> I run away on ships. I meet the Capitan. Here I am today. Pirate Espanol. Marion about Marion, eh? <laughs> I guess things weren't like you expected either, huh? The problems seemed to start as soon as we set foot here. Father always enjoyed hunting. Jumped on the opportunity to come. Didn't even bother to ask if we wanted to. Last time we saw him, he'd been gone for three weeks straight. 
They thought he was dead. Because he never showed up. <sighs> He'd almost starved. But it didn't bother him in the slightest. After he just left us again the next day, I knew there was no reason for us to stay there. At least you girls have each other. Try seven brothers who scurry as soon as the Redcoats showed up. Never did come back. Did they survive? Oh yes. Found out later they went to Philadelphia. Sold fish. Knew I was taken. Didn't even try. Last I ever saw of them. Never wanted to again. Way to help us cheer up, Joshua. My food just got turned into sad story time. It's good to understand each other. We've barely had a chance to really speak since meeting. Why? Because we've been robbing and plundering this whole time? Maybe he too embarrassed to say. I bet you've been chick, huh? <laughs> you know what? You're exactly right. <laughs> I'm just here to collect money to build a house back in Boston. But the money never came. Where's the captain? Why doesn't he share his tragic story? Captain Hippaxton? He demand respect though. You can't have that for someone you don't know everything about. Do you know? Wow, that's surprisingly deep, Marion. No! no, don't do it. Stop. So, Capitan, they finished Camir. They're waiting for you, my friend. My friends, how hard we've worked for this day. A day when we'll finally be able to enjoy the fruits of both our labors, as well as rest from our trials and sorrows. We were coaxed out here. Promises of great success and opportunity. Oh, how we were deceived. Our hardships began and haven't stopped since we stepped foot on this godforsaken land. And now, our motherlands have gone and turned the musket on each other, threatening us all with destruction and war. Well, my friends, war we will not enter. Neither destruction, nor failure, nor pennilessness because we have taken back what was rightfully ours from the beginning. Repayment for every last ounce of our labor. Hooray! We have taken back what is ours. We'll embrace the spoils of our desires resting on the shores of New Providence. Hooray! How's that, my friends? Warm sun instead of dark, bitter cold? Crystal waters? instead of this muddy, violent fill. No more are we traitors of filthy ratskins, but rather defenders of our own skin. Our pathetic company squandered our potential. Well, my boys, I can most assuredly say we've earned every ounce of it back. No more scrapping, no more aching, and finally, no more pain. Yeah!
Troopers, troopers! Get the gas! Get the gas! Pinchy cabrones, they kill him! You boys are here way too early! Men, get into position! Tristan was a good sailor! I'll make sure you British scum bleed for that! <laughs> Open fire! You scum! Are you okay? Prepare to charge. Oh no. Hope the rousing times are worth it. Check the corpses. Make sure these dogs are dead. <laughs> See you boys in here! I've heard about Captain Parnassus. I've heard about your naval savagery. <laughs> well, as flattered as I am that my reputation precedes me, I hardly think you will want to talk about savagery. I just came back from one of your little plunders. You know that little uh, trading company up the river basin? Ring any bells? It looked like what, from what we observed, 
is that they were led, bound, and executed by a single individual. <laughs> I suppose the rest of your little band didn't know about that, did they? Well, what did you tell them? That you, you left them out in the woods? <laughs> you see, you're no Robin Hood. You're not even a pirate. You're just... a murderer. Now, I suggest you lower your weapon before I have to spill your worthless blood all over the beach. And I would hate to do that. It would mar the scenery. Normally I might consider your request. I don't think my crew would take too kindly to that, so... as you! <laughs> <laughs>